Becky Beckett, yeah. back to back Princess Sophia champion. How, yeah. how are you feeling now? I good, yeah, good. A little bit tired, but really, really good. I'm really happy. And it was a, a mixed bag, but not only champion, I have to say, yeah. with a day to spare. First time you've done this? Oh yeah, never even come close before. I uh, didn't really even think it was possible for me. Um, so it's today, it's like since, finish sailing, it's since finishing sailing yesterday, it's all been a bit surreal. Like I really just just didn't know what to do with myself, <laughs> but still had to go sailing today. But it was great. I really enjoyed the Matarace just now and I'm yeah, really pleased. Looking back, I guess you say you haven't had time to think, but you, you must have felt that everything clicked a bit this week. Certainly into final series it did. Um, you know, qualifying I struggled a bit. I was about sixth or seventh. It wasn't going badly, but I was aware that I needed to somehow step it up a bit. And then, yeah, the last two days of final series, something just, it just worked. In the conditions we had, I was just able to find the right bits of the racetrack to be in. Um, and I was just really happy with how I sailed. Looking forward, uh, yeah, what do you think about the conditions there? Because it's not a big break, is it? No, it's, it would pretty much be flying in about a week. Um, yeah, I mean, this time last year, we had a lovely regatta, like moderate easterlies, nice sea state. Um, we have also had uh, that regatta at the same time of year, and it's been cold and really, really windy southwesterly. So, um, expect, expect anything? Expect anything, yes. <laughs> yes, be grateful for it. Yeah. Um, can I say, what does, uh, what does a full-time Ilka 7 do in his, in his week off then? Uh, I bought a house recently, which is in a slight state of disrepair. So I'll be painting stuff, putting stuff together, trying to buy furniture from charity shops and just, yeah, just generally a bit of housekeeping, really. Quite looking forward to it. Yeah. Well, welcome to Wheel Life. Growing up life, yeah. And many, many congratulations. Thank you, John. Thanks a lot. Marek Baumister, two events back to back, just uh, fresh from winning the Europeans, winning Palmer, day to spare. I, I don't know what else to say. Yeah, it's nice to be back. <laughs> it's nice to be back. I knew you put together really good series to win it with a, with a day to spare. Obviously had to do the middle race anyway, but what do you put that down to? I'm not quite sure. I'm just very pleased where I stand because uh, obviously I had Jesse, uh, she turns uh, one in mid-May. And um, it was just a little bit of a search how to combine the sailing with the home situation. And, and it's always sort of a uh, big give and take. And I'm not sure if I quite figured it out, but I'm just very pleased that if I have time to sail to be out on the water. So I really appreciate the sailing. Uh, you're, you're doing such a good job of it. I don't know how you say that. <laughs> yeah. Well, I don't know. I just really appreciate what the home front, I'm not sure if you call it that in English, but my boyfriend and my family is doing for me. And uh, also the full-time babysitter. And um, I'm happy to be here, but I'm also very happy to go home. We're really happy to have you here. Just for the for the folks home, you can really clearly explain why you weren't here last year. Yeah, I was uh, still pregnant though. It was almost my due date. So uh, um, I'm very grateful to be a mom and to experience it. And uh, uh, giving birth, I think, um, is such an, a painful but also an amazing experience. Uh, and I think it helps me a lot with my sailing. And going forward, are you going to do the sort of full full circuit this year or does motherly duties curtail that a little bit? Yeah, so yes, it's a bit too much, so I'll be in home. And it's nice that Holland warmed up a little bit, so I, I can train at home and put in some training out uh, used to do so i can't do all the events but i'm happy i did do these two and i'm happy that uh, the team is flexible and also mirt and maxi and marisa uh, they're pushing me really hard but they're okay with me not always being there so um yeah i'm in a happy place i i can see that and i have to say whatever you're doing is really working and very best of luck and i guess where will you see you next uh next one will probably be the test event Wow. Okay. Well, maybe see you in Marseille. See you in Marseille.